Good morning. It's really early. I have to um, get over to the studio now and clean up and uh, get this fan ready for an interview. I don't even know what time it is, but it's really early. Hey, this is Simon with the van, doing for CTV. Okay, uh, sure, come on in. Uh... Okay. They have a car crashed right through the wall up there. That's cool. All right, I've checked in with security. I'm gonna change out of my Pokemon shirt, get dressed in some, some I don't know, I guess something nice? Like, not too nice? I don't know. This is new for me. I've never been on TV. I'm gonna make some coffee and make some breakfast. Hang out here. The lighting guys are gonna be setting up lights and doing a bunch of tests and stuff, so... Um, I should probably get changed quickly. Alright. I couldn't find my nice belt, so... I'm gonna wear my Nintendo belt. At least I'm wearing a belt, I guess. That's a clean van, though, eh? I did good. Champ's gonna bark at every single person who comes in here, so uh, we gotta put him, put him out there. Cause you're so ill-behaved. You're a loud bastard. I've been miked. Now I'm getting powder. Yeah. Not makeup, just powder. Just, just, just a little powder. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not scared. I'm excited. <laughs> Very excited. I want to be the best me I possibly can. Okay. Perfect. People dress very nicely in my dirty old van. <laughs> Check this out. Hello! That's cool. Yeah, it's definitely like a camper van. Yeah. Or an RV inside of a camper van. I don't have to do it. I would have to like crouch down like this. Kevin we got lots of time. Okay. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. All right. That's it, that's all. I can take this tie off now. I think it went pretty good. It was uh, only a little nervous. It's stupid how TV does that to you. It makes you nervous. I have no idea what I'm gonna go do. I'm gonna make some breakfast. Breakfast? Breakfast. <laughs> So I just left downtown. I'm up in Vaughn. I like being more suburbs. Inner city kind of stresses me out. Parking, when parking's an issue, uh, you know, it, it makes your whole life an issue because now your house is going to get a ticket. And my budget's already kind of like swamped. And so, anyway, I'm going to just do some work here. There's a Starbucks nearby. I was going to like chill out and, and do some studying up on, on mechanics, call a bunch of people, do some editing on the videos. And try to figure out the next couple of days. A lot of family here in Toronto, so I want to see a lot of people. Um, tomorrow I'm actually going to meet up with uh, a buddy of mine and, and go for a little dirt bike, so that's fun. But uh, I'm going to make some breakfast here in the parking lot. Reflections on that interview. It was cool. Um, it's neat always like meeting TV, TV personalities and stuff like that. Like when I was doing photography, I'd meet a lot of politicians and a lot of uh, celebrities and stuff. And they always have like a charisma that like gravitates everyone around them to them so i was meeting that ben guy doing the interview like it's funny watching him walk into the space and having suddenly like eight nine people just like all watching him and what he did it's kind of cool um hopefully i think I've, it's very similar to the way youtubers are actually if you ever meet like a, a big bigger time vlogger or something like that they have this certain charisma that they just like draw everyone into them all the time 
um, yeah, hopefully, I guess that's a skill you got to learn how to do, right? That's something I got to figure out eventually. I want to make it big. I don't really want to make it big, but yeah, I do. I don't know that I want to be famous, but I do like making money off the internet about travel videos, and I love making these videos, and I love traveling full-time, so I think all of those things are symptoms of making it big. So I guess I want to make it big. But right now, I just want to make breakfast, so I'm going to do that. Did a lot of work today. Sat in that coffee shop for a long time, but uh, got some videos edited. I'm gonna change up the schedule soon and start posting like regular vlogs five days a week, like info videos once a week, and then um, I also wanna do like experimental videos, just like try out new, like other genres of videos. Like I really wanna do some moto vlogs for a bit. Maybe I'll do some makeup tutorials. I don't know, whatever. But, uh, Right now, I'm, I'm going to go visit my uncle and aunt, and I just pulled into their driveway. Champ is losing it. Champ, where are we? Where are we? He's pumped. Champ, the hot sauce. Champ, the hot sauce. No, not the hot sauce. Huh, not, not the hot sauce. You, you threw the hot sauce out the door. We need that. Both so vicious. Champ! What's wrong? I just finally got to see uh, my interview here. Guinness? Guinness is great, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, I'll share the bits and pieces of it. I'm going to share the whole thing, but I'll put a, a link to the whole thing down below and uh, you guys can check that out. I had to really like uh, decompress after that. It was actually kind of weird. I don't know. I think with all the big lights on you and stuff, you stress a little bit. I don't know how people do it every day. And uh, that downtown Toronto life is like, uh, it's anxiety driving for me, but I don't know. It's funny, I don't get this way about any other city. Just Toronto just drives me up the wall sometimes. It stresses me out, I don't get it. decision to get a camper trailer, do I? It's not me. No, 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 no. It's not my fault. <laughs> not your fault. Not my fault. Because my mom said the word RV a few times this summer. Really? Yeah. The woman who hated, hated, hated the RV that we had as kids has mentioned the word RV. No, no, we're definitely thinking that, that it's, it's kind of a, up, it upgrades us from camping. That it is. Power bar. 